welcome to my fourth ever video of Bugs of Henry. Now today, as you can tell by the title of this video, we're going to be meeting my new beetle, my new stag beetle. Um, yeah, I'm really excited to show him to you guys because uh, I haven't had much time to show him. So I'll start getting the enclosure open right now. So as you can see, you might be able to see the label down there. Kyoto the stag beetle and he's a Dorcas Antaeus. Yes, I spent money, a lot of money, on a Dorcas Antaeus. Now, these guys are specifically, not specifically, but they're very big. And yeah, they're specifically known for their big, broad mandibles. Um, he's in here. But yeah, and if you get one of these guys, just remember, don't, if he's aggressive, um, if he's a male and he's aggressive, don't try to you know get your fingers in the way of his mandibles you can see i'm just gonna get him out now here we go so this is him absolute beast of a stag beetle isn't he now you can see he's very shiny you can see him shining in the sunlight um and they're yeah as i said as you can see they're really well known for their big broad mandibles and um yeah, they're, they're, they're really big. I got I got mine classed as an extra large. Um, sorry, I'm just getting him in a more comfortable position. But yeah, and he, he is huge. Now, as you can see, they've got very long antlers um, because they need to fight other males, as most stag beetles do. So, obviously, they're not as long as, like, giraffe stag beetles, if you know what they are, but... You know, they're very big antlers, sometimes quite long, sometimes quite short. I'm pretty sure this is a species of short antlers, well, or with short antlers, but they can still have long ones. Now, as you can see, you might be able to see a couple of flies flying around. And now these guys are soil flies, and they are not fun to deal with. Now, these guys don't cause your bugs any problems at all, but they are just a pain. So, if you want to get rid of them, get soil fly traps or fruit fly traps. It depends what one you get. Just, yeah, just try to get rid of them. But they don't cause your bugs any harm, as I said, but just, yeah, just try not to. Just try not to have too many of them in with your bugs, because they're just annoying. Um, anyway, but, yeah, as you can see, he's... He's a nice big stag beetle, as I said. He, they're really, they're really big, broad, wide. Actually, they're known for pretty much their whole body being very broad and wide. And my one's about mm, seven and a half um, centimeters. So yeah, very big stag beetle. You can see I feed him off, feed him off of beetle jelly in here. Um, I just, I just got that. Um, and yeah, he has plenty of climbing stuff. Now, I'm not going to do a full how to care for stag beetles, but I will give you a couple of tips, but I will I will do how to care for stag beetles. Um, but yeah, um, so I'm really happy, just, just to quickly uh, go away from the um, whole, you know, look at my new stag beetle thing. I'm really happy with all the support I've been getting on my videos. Not like comments or anything, just all the likes and views they've been getting. It really means a lot to me, guys, so thank you so much. And, um, yeah, I'd be, I'd be really happy if this video gets, like, 10 likes. Like, if we get that, then I'll do a how to care for stag beetles. Actually, I'll do it anyway. <laughs> I don't even mind. But, yeah, you can see, as, as I said, um, I'm going to do a bit of a couple of tips for how to care for them. As you can see, I've got these pieces of wood. Now, this piece is really good because it's part of a log. So, it's like a big, like, U-shaped hide, like that shape. And it's really good for him to hide under. This bit's a big piece. And then this is this is a piece that I got from a place called Pets at Home, and yeah, they they do good stuff for pets. Um, they got pets in their name, so but yeah, and but I didn't get Kyoto from Pets at Home. I got him from Richard's Inverts, along with um, Romeo the Stag Beetle, that Flower Beetle Grub, and a few others. I yeah, I'm pretty sure I got a few others. Um, and I'm really happy um, with how he came. He's in really good. He's in, he's in a really good 
um, mood right now, so I'm happy with um, how he is. But yeah, and they just yeah. After this video, after you watch this video, go on to Google and go to Richard Dinvert's website. And if you like stag beetles as much as I do, go and buy something. Um, you know, just check them out, support them. They have a YouTube channel. Go subscribe, like their videos, or his videos. Just yeah, just do as much as you can to support them because. Um, yeah, they're just really good at, um, selling beetles and stuff, but yeah, and, um, there's not much else for me to say, but, um, just so you know, just a quick, um, thing away from stag beetles, um, yeah, just, as I said, you know, thanks for the support on my videos, and yeah, as I said, if this video gets 10 likes, it would mean a lot to me, uh, watch out for my next video, bye!